there, I'm Frances Valentine, and I have the great privilege today of interviewing Ian Spelter, who's the Director of Design at Instagram. You talked earlier this morning, you talked about uh, that data can inspire you, mm -hmm. but you also said it won't save you. So when you have an understanding of what your customers are doing, so and data could be like really big data, data or maybe it's just from you talking to your customers and getting insights that way, right? Um, I think it's important to understand how are they using your product or you, you know, maybe it's customers you don't have yet and understanding what their needs are. And so if you understand that more deeply, then you can it can inspire you to create solutions for them that solve their problems better, right? When we work at a large scale, of course, that data comes from, you know, usage data and things like that. But I feel like it it's a thought that scales down as well, you know, where it's just like, how often are you talking to your customers and, and how well do you understand what their needs are? Um, and then how do you take those insights and, and create um, either new services or adjust your product to better solve their needs? Right? And then uh, when I say it won't save you, I think what I'm speaking more to that is larger scale companies, when you have all these numbers, all this numerical data, um, there can be a, a tendency to just kind of follow where that takes you and you can kind of get lost there or, or just start to optimize for just very local wins as opposed to seeing larger opportunities around the corner or maybe might take you to a place you don't want to go as a business. And so I feel like it's really important for you to have a clear sense of what your purpose is uh, and what's, what do you feel like is important, what do you feel like you want to bring to the world um, and not just let data just decide that for you. I like to say that you can't A, B test your way to a product vision, sure. right? And I feel like that comes from insights, but it's not just from like kind of chasing where, where some sort of tests might take you. So where's the relationship between data informed and customer centric? Mm -hmm. you know, are they the same thing or could they be conflicting? Well, um, I think uh, well, particularly when you frame up data, uh, so it's data driven, but I would say data informed is a better better framing um, because it's that you know, there's other, it assumes that there are other inputs into the process, uh, decide like what you're actually, how you're gonna make decisions. But I do think that yes, being data informed is important to being customer centric because ideally you'll understand more about your customers um, if you leverage data well. Mm -hmm.